So it's currently 9.16 in the morning, and look what Chris pulled in. How long is that one? It's, uh, 15 inches. And we're hitting the hot colors golden pink today. Let's keep her going. Chris caught a little dink. Yeah, dink. About 12 inches. They're hitting on the bottom, and how deep are we? 22 feet. Same as yesterday. All right, guys, I'm going to be honest. I was sleeping with my rod in my hand, and look what happened. Woo! Got my first walleye ever. Let's measure it. All right, guys, so he is 11 inches, and I caught him on a pink and gold, two-bladed, uh, it's like a ground snapper. I'll show you guys in a second. But I don't think this is a walleye. I think it's a sauger, sogai. I don't know. But I got my first fish ice fishing. Let's go. All right, here you guys go. This side's gold, this side's straight out pink. You got two blades on there, and I got a red treble hook. I was letting it sit on the bottom. I was passed out, and all of a sudden I felt my rod just, like, get tugged. And I set that hook, and oh my god, happiest feeling ever. It took me three days to get a damn fish. Okay, so, uh, we're over here at Gold's Rock on the Lake of the Woods still. Uh, didn't get to go to the hotel yesterday, so my hair is a freaking mess. So whatever. But, uh, I don't have my glasses. They're in the car, so I can barely see out on the horizon on the ice. So, I can barely spot houses and where what's coming at. If there's a storm coming in and all that. But, it's whatever. But, Chris uh, decided to go more east, where the water hits 30 feet. He took the, uh, the drill, and he took his... Uh, his lure, the one he's been catching them on all the time. The, uh, I showed you guys in day one, so check that out if you guys haven't seen that. So unfortunately, as Chris went to the east, uh, he's going around the whole rock, if he can't get anything over there. Uh, he's going to try all in the deep end, 30, 31 feet, and right now I'm still at 22 feet, and I just caught that sauger, and I know it's a sauger because it's brown and it's got straight lines, and I just got a bite. And the walleye looks completely different from it, so I think it's a sauger. But other than that, I'm out of heat. <laughs> Propane tanks are empty. As you, there's no heat going on, so this sucks. But it took me three days just to get this damn fish. 11 inches, though. I mean, come on. He wants me to get 28 inches because you can have three fish that are below 18 inches and then you can have one fish that is over 28 inches and you can have a total of four in your limit so we're trying to get a big one but hey we're out here having a good time I mean you can't get snow or ice out here in Indiana this year the winter sucks it is currently 12 degrees this morning when we came out here around 6 uh, it was like negative 2 it was freaking cold Alright, so I got two poles set up. Uh, they're both pink. Um, the one I caught the soccer on was pink and gold, and that's still out there on this one. Uh, I'm dead sticking them, let them pick it off off the bottom when they come through. But I want to show you guys the outside of where I'm at. I can't see because I glared in my face, but this is where we're at on the middle of the ice. We got a uh, nine inch ice out here. I think I can see Chris. No, that's not him. I have no idea where he went. He went to the east, so he's got to be out this way. But that's Gold's Rock. I'm on the uh, southern point. They should be coming through this point all day. I chose to stay here and Chris is out there with no tent or anything, so we're about a mile, two miles offshore. We went further than we did yesterday. Caught one yesterday. That's that one. That one's, no, that's the one we got today. That's the uh, walleye and that's my little sauger. And then the one we caught, he took the sled, so he's, nope. It's actually right here. Here's the one he caught yesterday. It's good and then everything ready for him to cook. Oh. 
Man, I'm having a good time all by myself. Where's Chris?